Hello, very good morning. Today our topic is introduction to software engineering. The software is defined as instructions. That is programs that when executed provide the desired function. The software can be desired, defined as data structures. It enables the program to adequately manipulate the information. And the software can be defined as the documents. The documents describe the operation and use of the programs. Now, we will see the definition of engineering. It is an application of science tools and methods to find cost-effective solution to the problems. Definition of software engineering. Software engineering is defined as systematic, disciplined, and quantifiable approach for the development, the operation, and the maintenance of the software. Now, we will see the introduction to software engineering with characteristics of software. The software has various characteristics. The software is developed or engineered. It is not manufactured in the classic sense. Software does not wear out. However, it deteriorates due to change. Software is custom built rather than assembling existing components. Although the industry is moving towards component-based instruction, most software continues to be custom built. Now, we will see the changing nature of the software. Software may be classified into various categories. The various categories are system software, application software, engineering and scientific software, embedded software, product line software, web application, and artificial intelligence software. The system software. The system software is a collection of programs written to service other programs. Embedded software, it resides in read-only memory, it is used to control products and the system for the consumer and industrial markets. Artificial intelligence software. Artificial intelligence software makes use of non-numeric algorithms to solve complex problems that are not amenable to computation or straightforward analysis. Engineering and scientific software. Engineering and scientific software have been characterized by number crunching algorithms. Then we will see the legacy software. Legacy software are older programs that are developed decades ago. The quality of legacy software is poor because it has an inextensible design, convoluted code, poor and non-existent in documentation, text cases and the results that are not achieved. And then we will see as the time progress, the system evolved during due to following reasons. The software must be adapted to meet needs of new computing environment and technology. The software must be enhanced to implement the new business requirements. The software must be extended to make it operable with uh, more modern systems or database. The software must be re-architectured re to make it viable within a network environment. The software engineering can be viewed as a layered technologies. The layer, uh, the, there are four layers are away. The bottom layer is quality, quality of focus, and the next level layer is process, and the next level is method, and the final layer is tools. Now we will see the quality of focus. That is the bottom layer of the software engineering. It is bedrock that supports software engineering. And process, process is nothing but foundation for software engineering. Methods, it provides technical how tools for building the software, tools that provide semi automatic and automatic support to the methods. And now we will see a process framework. A framework establishes the foundation for a complete software process. It identifies a number of framework activities applicable to all software projects. It also includes a set of, a set of umbrella activities that are applicable across the entire software process. The process framework can be uh, given in a diagrammatical manner. A process framework consists of framework activities and it contains uh, umbrella activities. Under the umbrella activities, some tasks are available. The task can be set with the milestones and the software quality assurance points. Now we will see that 
software process uh, generic activities. There are uh, some generic activities under the software process. These are communication, planning, modeling, construction, and the deployment. And uh, there are uh, some generic view of engineering complemented by the number of uh, umbrella activities. The umbrella activities are software project tracking and control, formal technical reviews, software quality assurance, software configuration management, document preparation and production, reusability management, measurement, risk management. Now we will see one model, CMO, Capability Maturity Model Integration. It is developed by Software Engineering Institute. It assesses the process model followed by an organization and grade the organization with the different elements. A set of software engineering capabilities should be present as organization reach different levels of process capability and maturity. CMMI process meta model can be represented in two ways. One is continuous ways and another way is a stage. Continuous model lets the organization select the specific improvement that best meet its business objective and minimize the risk. Its levels are called capability levels. It describes the process in two dimensions. Each process area is assessed against specific goals and practices and is rated according to the following capability. CMMI continues with the model. There are six levels in the CMMI. Level 0, Level 1, Level 2, Level 3, Level 4, and Level 3. Level 0 is incomplete. Level 1 is principal. Level 2 is managed. Level 3 is principal. Level 4 is quantitatively managed. Level 5 is optimized. Then we will see what is income. Incomplete is nothing but it is a process in matter. Its objective and goal of process are not defined or not known. And perform goal, objective, work, task, work, product, and other activities are carried out. Management, all the activities are monitored, reviewed, evaluated, and reviewed. Now we will see another uh, uh, model, demo. Activities are characterized, integrated, and developed. Now we'll see another model, quantitative 